We are on a quest to find products that not only have a wow factor to them, but may prove to be more beneficial than your everyday office equipment. Well behold, ProtoArc has sent me some quirky toys and we're going to try to find out if they work. So let's get right into it. So the first one here is something that I have reviewed before from a different company, but this one is slightly different. This one here is their ergonomic vertical mouse. And by ergonomic, I mean like it's like ergonomic times 10. The whole point of a mouse like this is to rotate your wrist into a neutral position. Because believe it or not, whenever you're using your typical mouse, you're actually pronating your hands, which after extended use could lead to strain or possibly carpal tunnel. And we don't want that. So this mouse achieves that nice, comfortable vertical hand position, all while adding that little RGB spectacle every time you move your mouse around. So after using it quite a bit, it definitely feels comfortable to use for your everyday office use. Definitely not for gaming though. You can never get a high level of precision with a mouse like this versus something like an actual gaming mouse. But that high level of comfort, plus the fact that it has all the buttons you would expect from a traditional mouse and dual connectivity so you can connect it to two separate computers with a click of a button, really makes this ideal for office use especially. But unlike your normal office mouse, this does have a different look and feel to it. So it's going to take quite a bit of time to get used to this as opposed to your traditional mouse. Okay, so this mouse here is actually quite interesting. I have seen mouses like this before, but I've never used one until now. And this obvious trackball thing on the side is not exactly what I thought it was gonna be. At first I thought maybe the trackball is for scrolling up and down pages, but then I remembered, well, that's what the mouse wheel is for. Then I noticed there's no light sensor on the bottom of the controller. So this can only mean that the trackball controls your mouse cursor. And after using this mouse, I, I just have to ask the question, why? Like, why would anybody buy a trackball mouse? Because you're essentially taking all the best features that a mouse offers, like giving you precise aim using your entire arm, and you're giving that all away so you could use it with your thumb. Like, you know how they have the debate with controllers versus mouse and keyboard players? Well, this is basically, if you took all the cons of a controller and you combine it with all the cons of mouse and keyboard, the offspring of that would be a trackball mouse. Ooh. Now, despite all that, I did come up with three reasons why you would buy yourself a trackball mouse. Option number one is that you broke your right arm and now you can't move it and you can only move your hand. Option number two is because you're looking for a fun party trick and you want to show all your pals whenever they come over to your house. And option number three, it's because you're bored. Other than that, I really can't see why anybody would buy a trackball mouse. If you guys have a trackball mouse or know somebody that does, let me know in the comment section down below. I really want to know why anybody would buy this please. Now let's say you do fit in one of the three categories that I mentioned earlier and you are looking for a trackball mouse. Then this Proto Arc one here is actually not too bad. It does have a cool feature where you could adjust the two tilt adjustments whenever you want. And I wish more mice would have this feature because it's actually useful to be chilling doing office work on the vertical mode and then switch over to the flat mode whenever you're ready to wreck some noobs. And then this mouse does have a nice ring RGB with different color modes that you could choose from using the buttons on the side. Moving on to our last and final product. We're gonna change gears and we're gonna go over to the keyboard side because we have not talked about that yet. Now, out of all the products I've talked about thus far, this is probably the most useful out of the three. When you're typing on a keyboard, your hand tends to angle inwards, forcing you to overcompensate that tilt by angling your wrist outwards, which of course can lead to fatigue. So with this angled keyboard, you could type with both sides 
already tilted, so it's much more natural in its hand position. And not only that, this one does allow you to connect to multiple devices and switch between each one with a click of the button. It does have MIDI controls in the middle and has a host of features that you can control using your F keys. So it does have some great quality of life features to talk about indeed. Now of course, it does come with one big drawback, and that is the tilt. The tilt is going to take some getting used to, especially if you're already used to typing on the other side of the keyboard with your opposite hand. But in and of itself, that's actually a good thing because it's actually teaching you to type properly and you're probably going to type faster over time the more you use this type of keyboard. So these are the three interesting products that I wanted to share with you guys today. Let me know if you guys have any questions in the comment section below. And also, if you guys are looking to buy any of these products, especially the trackball mouse, I know there's that one person out there. You guys will find those links in the description down below. Of course, a thank you ProtoArc for sending me these products. But anyways, guys, my name is Matthew. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, peace out.